Howdy folks, Deacon Parsons here. It's been about four months since my last video. Sorry about that, but I've been dealing with a little health issue. Good news on that front, the cancer they tell me is all gone. It was caught early. Uh, still recovering a bit, but uh, things seem to be moving positively in that direction. Well, going through all this, Princess Full Moon Running Bear and I did some traveling and spent some time in various offices convenience stores, that sort of thing. And we noticed an aggravating pattern. In most places with two restrooms, one's marked for males and the other's marked for females. Now, if those specific restrooms accommodate more than one customer at a time, that's fine. That makes sense. However, many times said restrooms are single occupancy. If that's the case, having a line to get in one restroom while the other single occupancy restroom is empty is just ludicrous. Normally waiting around isn't a problem, but if you're a small child or pregnant or someone fresh from a medical procedure, time is not always your friend. Now I looked up online and, and many companies sell unisex restroom signs, some with nice self-adhesive backs for as little as $10 each. I know it's a small thing for most people, but this is a bipartisan issue that everybody can get behind if they think about it. Next time you see this circumstance, take a moment to politely mention to the establishment that unisex restrooms make better use of their facilities and serve their customers. You can also like and share this video and spread the word. I'm sure most people are like me, never really thought about it, until it became a problem for them. This is Deacon Parsons saying, love your maker, love your mate, and do what's right because it's right, and devil take the highmost.